What is up, you guys? And welcome back to another video. I'm not gonna lie, this video, I kinda, I didn't steal that deer, but someone kindly slid into my DMs and suggested that deer. So thank you to this guy. I forgot which guy it was when I started filming. Basically, I will be styling my best friend. Best friend? Nah. I'll be styling a friend's favorite piece of clothing. Oh, friend! Oh, new friend! friend. Oh, friend. None other than Jacob Wallace. Oh, that's all good. <laughs> oh, first, wait in the nervous, first time, first time on the couch. On this one? Bit of interracial fun. This guy, this guy. All right, hit me, what do you want? What do you want from me? So, basically, I need to stop clapping. Sanjeev has a very iconic style, he's got a very personal style, and looks freaking dope. So I've had Aww. a San... All right, <laughs> mate, all right, mate. No touching, please. <laughs> I've had Sanju bring his three favorite items and then I need to start uh, I need to style them myself So I need to put my own spin on it, my own twist on it and make it mine Why don't you take the floor from now on? Sick Big right. man Sand. Well before I even start I'm just curious as to what piece you think I'm gonna bring You did bring like a semi-transparent bag So no one of them is a Craig Green jacket What did you think okay. I would bring? Was the question Craig Green jacket, Balenciaga Sherling jacket That's very autumn winter And then maybe... Actually I could imagine you bringing the pink Craig Green jacket as well But... <laughs> oh. Alright, so uh, first piece that we got, it's one of my favourites. Okay. Undercover, cropped. Very cropped. It's not that cropped. It's pretty cropped. It's not that cropped. A sweatshirt from, it was from, I want to say, Fall Winter. Yeah, Ultimate 18. I swear that's when they brought out three cropped hoodies. Oh yeah, you're right. And then... Wait, was it 18? Oh yeah, you're right, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, you're right, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, you're right, yeah. 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 So yeah, cropped in the body, elongated sleeve with some distressed detailing. And, I'm um, never a fan of this piece, but... Really? Bro, I love this piece. It's so good. The thing is, you're like five foot three, so that's why it's not really that cropped. But for me, it's going to be a bit. Yeah, I'm sure we'll do something cool with this. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing how he does it. Truth be told, my favourite pair of trousers would have been some black trousers. Skinnies. Well, like black trousers. Probably those, those, uh, nah, those Saint Laurent pirate ones. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> but A, you've already done that, and B, I thought black trousers would be so basic and it would be so easy for you. So, another pair of just amazing trousers, what trousers for slash sweatpants that I love. Hyder. Yeah, gotcha. Hyder from Fall Winter 14. There's probably sh stains everywhere, but. Are these drop crotch? Um, but like then you. You, <laughs> you, can, you can obviously yank them up, wear them high. Did you not hear what Karl Lagerfeld said? If you wear sweatpants, you've You're, given up on your life. You've given up on life, yeah. And last but not the least. Well, one of my favorite pieces that you've got. Craig is so sick. This is one of my favorite collections he's done. Just because I love this stuff and it's a bit more colorful. It's just a shame it's dirty, but yeah. you know. I'm sorry, mate, but I actually wear my clothes and I don't just show them on YouTube and then... No, I'll wear my and clothes and once and, and then I sell them. And then sell them, so. Yeah. I think this looks awesome. I think this is the one piece that you'll pull off in a very sick way. Yeah, I can already see this. Base trousers, wide air force <laughs> ones, and you know. All that good shit. Very well, iconic from Magnus. Man. I'm excited. So basically, what the plan is now is that I'm gonna shoot some B-roll. I'm gonna try all these items next week. We're gonna sit down again. I'm gonna show Sanj all the B-roll, and he's gonna rate it from one to ten, essentially. I'm not nervous. I'm excited. Are yeah. you excited? No, it'll be fun. I think you do a good job. Magnus knows how to dress. It's yeah. not that hard. Yeah. So I'll see you guys. I I don't know. I might see you guys tomorrow. Actually. <laughs> so let's get it, boys. It's now the morning after and I've kind of had to think about what I'm going to wear the stuff with. But to kind of go through the pieces, first up we've got this obviously Craig Green jacket. This is pretty much just like a big statement piece, so I'm not going to do anything crazy with that. I'm just going to keep it fairly simple. I love that jacket. I think that jacket is sick. The detailing is amazing. I like this kind of mix between samurai jack and a high-vis vest in a way. Next up we've got the undercover cropped hoodie, cropped sweatshirt. Not a fan. I just can't really do crop stuff. Probably cropped like here, and it's just too crop for me. But I'm probably gonna go from some high-waisted trousers, maybe be a bit cheeky, and layer a hoodie underneath it. <coughs> Clever boys. Oh my god, mate. This is the last thing. Like, look at the size of this waist. Look how big that is. If I just stand like this, they just fall down. They are horrible. They're like drop crotch. Feel looks like I've shat myself. Sanch, I don't know why why you would want to like drop crutch, but 
I'll do my best. I'll try to style them. Pray for me, because this is gonna be a hard, hard task to style these. Hider, make some wires, leather jacket, and some top cropped on the cover. I think we're gonna go with 80s, just because they've got such a big size, they're kind of bulky. So I feel like that might go nicely. With the Craig Green, I'm either gonna do it with these Dries trousers, or I'm gonna do it with the 80s I'm wearing today. I need to decide, and then either Docs or JWs. I am trying to make it a bit more interesting by going slightly out of my comfort zone. Because it is very much statement pieces, I feel like it might be hard to add extra to it instead of just like supporting the outfit. But we'll see. So I'm wearing the Hyder Ackerman trousers and it honestly feels like I've sh myself. Drop crotch is horrible. It looks really, really bad. It's really uncomfortable. I don't know why people like it. I've never understood it and I probably never will. Oh, hey guys, didn't see you there. Did you know that right now on running.co.uk you can pre-order beautiful corduroy overshirts in green, navy or cream? How about a pair of cream corduroy trousers? These corduroy pieces are made from the finest Italian corduroy. 100% cotton, beautiful finish. So what are you waiting for? Go cop your pair at running.co.uk. You can also use the code SET for £10 off if you purchase any color shirt with any color trousers. Code suitable for a lot. Pretty good. Welcome back. Welcome back to the couch. Oh, thank you, sir. While Sanjeev has been gone, I basically linked up with my boy and we shot some B-roll. I'm basically gonna show Sanjeev the B-roll I've shot. I'm gonna give my opinion and my thoughts behind it first. Right. And then I want your criticism. Just like we can have a chat Just about like it, basically. From one to ten. Just straight up. Be right. harsh. So I have a feeling I'm gonna be way too positive. Just be harsh. Even you, I'll be harsh. You, you dress well, so I'll be without, without to trying to be all up in your bum hole. Do you want to start with the undercover? Sure. I'm just curious, so which one was your favourite to start with? Presumably the Craig Green. Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> Okay, my thoughts, or do you want to go for your thoughts first? Okay, well I'll go first then. Okay. It is autumn winter, you know, it is cold out in these streets. One of the reasons why I hated this piece was because the neckline is so big, mm -hmm. so you can't really have a t-shirt underneath it because it'd be so contrasty. So I thought I'm gonna layer it with a hoodie underneath. Obviously I had a running hoodie, running hoodie underneath. <laughs> my Shivanchi suit trousers and some 80s. Personally, I love what you did with the hoodie. I think that's actually sick. The hoodie underneath is a dope look. Uh, I like the boots. I just feel like for me, if you were to wear such wham shoes, trousers need to be even more wham because it kind of gives you like clown feet. Yeah, to no, me. definitely. So, I mean, it's still a very strong look. So I'd say a strong seven out of 10. That was very generous. <laughs> Can't wait for these next ones. Next one is gonna be Tyra <laughs> Ackerman. They're horrible, they are dog <laughs> shit. This is not my proudest. This is definitely not my proudest. I'm surprised you went with the wires here. Yeah. I had to. Perfect. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, very short. Basically, my thoughts were that Pied Ackerman uses a lot of earthy tones. I'm gonna wear it with my mustard kind of mock neck and then this green diesel bomber jacket it's either the wyatt's or the my dog martins okay yeah those are the two sort of shoes that i would normally pair it with exactly and that's because you can't really wear that with a trainer it's just gonna look weird yeah i really didn't like that outfit <laughs> i just really didn't like that outfit. uh i like the bottom half because i feel like that's how i would wear it i love the jacket i'm not too keen on the mustard jumper personally but yeah no it, it does look a bit weird i feel like the jacket is a bit too slim fitting and too like fitted for the bottom half because the bottom half is a lot more relaxed and a bit more grungy Sweat if you want to yeah. call it so for that i would probably give you a 
It's a it's a five out of ten. I'd give myself a three. It's not I that would. bad. I've hated it. It's not that hated bad. It. There's there's a few things that could be better, but yeah, five out of ten. It means it's okay. Yeah, it's barely just barely okay. Last one, obviously, the Cray Green Jacket. Now this is very much of like a statement piece. I'll get into that a bit later after this little segment. You've stepped up the B-roll, mate. <laughs> Obviously, Magnus used to give his raise to, uh, to yeah. his editor, mate. It's not my editor, it's only, it's only, <laughs> it's only the B roll, not the whole thing. Oh, right. Obviously, this is a super sick statement piece. I was either gonna do with my Navy Dries trousers, but I thought that would be too easy, mm -hmm. just be boring, just whatever. Yeah. Decided to go for my Ecru 80s jeans, just because it kind of matches this color, but mm -hmm. it still kind of elevates the outfit because there's so much going on on the top half. I also wanted to supplement that with the Jill Bannerton shoes. Now I know that the shoes are black and the jacket is more navy. Don't care, mate. Don't care. So. No, this is such a strong fit. I love it. I actually really like it. Let me think. If I was to be critical about it, I'd love to have seen what you did underneath. Just like, a white t-shirt. Just a white tee. Okay, cool. Yeah. Fair enough. Love the jeans. I love the, as you said, like the fact that it kind of matches with the band. Pretty good kick. You got some good height on that shit, bro. Good height. <laughs> I like, like the shoes. Yeah, this look is actually perfect. It's a look that I can see myself pulling off, so for that reason, you can. It's definitely like a high eight, high nine. I'm usually a bit funny about cuffed jeans, but I feel like they they work in this instant. It's so, a sick look, very very decent, mate. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, I'd say strong eight to strong nine. Like, do you know what I mean? Strong eight to nine. Nine, 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 nine. Yeah, so like an eight point five. So basically, I can't fault it. So actually, it's a nine. I'll give it a nine. Nine. You can never get ten. Ten doesn't exist. Unless it's me. Unless it's you. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> so basically, I got a, a, a strong seven for uh -huh. the first one. I probably want to give myself like a six for that. I wasn't a big fan of the shoe to pan combo. Yeah. So wait, if you weren't a fan of it, why'd you do it? Because that was the only shoe that I kind of felt matched that aesthetic. It was a very cropped look. Second one, I got, what, three? Yeah. I, think, I think a five is all right. I Maybe think... a four. I think a seven, four, and a nine. You did well. Blessings. Yeah, Bless I mean, they were fairly easy pieces to style anyway, besides maybe the, the drop crotch trousers. No, definitely. So yeah, <laughs> that's it. Let, let me know down in the comments what, what you guys think. Massive thank you to Sanjeev for coming. Oh, massive thank you to you, mate, for having maybe, me. Maybe we'll have Sanjeev trying some base trousers. <gasps> I already have some. In fact, you should go check out my look. My look, my video. Your look. On the Margella Tabi boots, mate. They're not beige, they're cream. Sorry. Yeah. It's yours anyway. Take that plug, mate. Massive thank you to Sanjeev for pulling through. Make sure to go check out his channel. It'll be linked down in the description to his YouTube, Instagram, all that spiel. Thanks, dude. Thanks, Thanks mate. Thanks, bro. Now we just need to do a sick thumbnail. What's the thumbnail? Chilled, laid back. No, I think the thumbnail is this side of the screen is going to be blocked by one of the outfits. Okay. And then <gasps> you need to do that one. I'm not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way I'm doing that. See mate. ya, mate. Ah, oh, the boy did well. But this again goes to show that it doesn't matter if you have the good pieces, you still need the taste that comes with it. What? <laughs> I think the, the thing to take away from this, like how you just... the, the thing to take away from this is that we all have different wardrobes, uh -huh. and just like Sanj probably has a million ways to style the stuff, these pieces. Mm -hmm. I only found a few ways that I think were cool. Just like if I gave Sanj some of my pieces, I'm sure he'd do really well, but he'd still feel limited to a certain amount of pieces. That's a lie. We'll see. If it's these trousers, I'll probably leave them where they were, to be honest with you. In the bin. At least not the hoodie. What's, what's... <laughs> yeah, the hoodie's fine, isn't it? Ronnie.co.uk, check it out. Set for extra 10 pounds off. Well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> there you go, love. Peace.